International Exports Limited, just your typical exporting business in a back alley of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Or is it? Welcome to Safe House, the ultimate hidden lair. This is one top secret restaurant where customers can literally disappear. The safe House is a spy's haven. This place where spies hide out when they're on a mission. Everything in the safe house is off the record. Even if you locate it, getting in will take all your spy savvy. To get past the entrance, you've got to know the password. And if you don't, you better look good guessing it, because hidden surveillance cameras are watching you, and the entire restaurant can see you before you even walk in. Off the streets, they may be regular people then, but when they come in here, they're agents, and they're part of this secret organization. Welcome, agents. Please watch your step on the way in here. Opened in 1966, this retro house of espionage is the brainchild of spy aficionado and owner, David Baldwin. Back in the 1960s, the Cold War made people spy crazy. David saw potential in this new fad and converted an old jazz club into a spy haven, and the safe house was born. Today, David and his wife Shauna operate the most clandestine restaurant in the country. Everywhere you look, there are spy holes to peep through, two-way mirrors for spying on your friends, and a labyrinth of secret passageways so complicated that guests sometimes get lost. And some people couldn't find their way out and they got locked in all night. Oh, yes. Time. That's, uh, yeah, they <laughs> that were locked happened. in. Yeah. It's a little something different. There's a surprise at every corner. <laughs> yep. Nothing is what it seems at Safe House. Even the menu is spy themed. And the most tricked out spy item? That would be the spy teeny. We have a very, very uh, special martini. And this martini, it's served shaken but not stirred. An ultimate martini on the way. Put the special shaker in here. Put it on in. Send it on out. This spy shaker shoots through 600 feet of tubing around the restaurant just to create the perfect shake. That's right, it travels along the ceiling of almost every room in the pub and ends up right back here. There, sir, enjoy. It's the perfect martini, just the way 007 drinks something. And this might look like an ordinary restaurant booth, but it's actually a secret door. This is our revolving booth. It ends up on the other side um, in another secret room. This is a great way to get rid of somebody if you're being followed. Spies have been known to disappear in it. And all of a sudden, the room started rotating, and we ended up in a totally different place. This covert cubbyhole actually takes you to the social club next door. And then there are the two phone booths. One provides alibis. This is the alibi phone, and it has an alibi for anything that you may need it for. We have a choice of a uh, hundred different noises to back up your lies. We have some gunshots in the background, so I can call somebody and say, you know, I'm under fire, I can't be home for a while. Hey, hey Mom, how's it going? I just wanted you to know that I won't be able to uh, make it home tonight. But actually, I'm in the military now. Yes, you can tell them you've joined the Army, or you're fleeing a nuclear air raid. There's the air raid. You know, run for your lives, everybody. And the other phone booth? It'll help you make a discreet escape. This is the secret way to get out, just in case somebody's following you. This escape is no joke. It was once used by an actual spy. That's cool. Soon after the safe house opened its doors in the 60s, a spy fleeing the FBI sought refuge in the underground pub. But when the feds followed him in, he was nowhere to be found. He'd gone out the escape route, and he actually escaped from the agents. Spy tested, spy approved. Thank <laughs> you.